Well, how are you doing today? Walton Jim, standing here in a barley field on the Delmarva Peninsula. Today's little uh, YouTube video is going to be about uh, what we do with this barley and how we use it at the brewery. That's right, Jim. We're going to show you uh, details of how it looks up close after it's been malted and then exactly what we do to it when we open our bags at the brew house and start to use it for a batch of beer. And how it ends up getting sent off to a dairy farmer at the end, the spent grain, and how we get uh, free beef because of that. So uh, sit back and enjoy. So good. Oh. Are we doing the video about malt today? Come in the lab, let's talk. Hey everybody, I'm Casey with Forum and Old Dominion and today we're talking about barley. Uh, the origin and frankly how it gets from the farm to the malting facility and ends up at our brewery so we can brew all the spirit to get out to you guys. Um, actually, once a farmer cultivates his harvest of barley uh, I know this sounds really complicated, so stay with me, folks. Uh, cultivates barley. We can't actually put it directly into the brewery. It needs to go through a process called malting. So what the farmer does is he ships all the barley over to a maltster or a malting facility, and it undergoes three steps, steeping, germination, and kilning. In the first stage steeping, the barley is actually immersed in water, encouraging it to grow, followed by periods where water is actually drained away. And this process is usually about two to three days whereas the whole malting process is about a week. Step two is germination, where that same wetted grain is allowed to grow under control conditions. And during this stage is when the grain is altered, sugars are produced from the grain start store, and natural enzymes develop. And last but not least is kilning or drying, my favorite part of the phase. And this is where malts are dried under various temperatures to achieve desired colors, flavors and aromas in the beer we drink every day. So after the kilning process, the maltster sits on the barley malt for approximately one to two weeks before it's shipped out to brewers all across the world. 